Hello, welcome back to Slay the Spire. Uh, it's been a little while since I recorded, and as you can probably see since there is a uh, date on the screen, I didn't even realize. Um, fun new thing, there's now a fast mode in the preferences. And that's going to make things a lot more interesting. So I've unlocked everything for the silent. I did that off camera, My, I think. I don't think I unlocked it in my last run, which I believe I won as the silent. Oh, uh, we're going to try a new format. I'm going to go through as far as I can get into the game in one episode, one long form episode, which shouldn't take nearly as long because of some interesting things. So we're going to, now that I've beaten the game, uh, we're going to go for obtain a reign of boss. Oh my, why have you given me the worst thing possible? Well, tiny house is not the worst relic I could have gotten actually, but it's a really boring relic. We'll go with carnage. So, I would like to... I have extra gold, so this isn't a bad idea. We'll go here, we'll go question mark, we'll go gold. And we'll move up in the world after that. Yeah, look at this. It's so much faster now. Oh my god. This is gonna make the episode so much shorter. I actually was watching... Ah, um... oh, I don't have enough energy to make that work. Uh, I can... I can't afford to lose too much. Let's just... You know what? A little bit more damage is fine. Oh, this is... It, it really just, like, pops. It's so snappy. It's so fast. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Alright. So, we've got Ethereal, Carnage, um... Iron Wave's a good card. Let's go with that. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. So, I would love to... Transform a strike. Havoc. Eh, not the worst card we could have gotten. I like. Now, now hear me out here. I like Tiny Chest. It, it, it's not optimal, but we can go to this question mark and look, we're going to get a chest. We didn't get a chest. That's worth it. 21 damage, 100% worth it. Let's go. We now get extra gold. See, look at how much faster this goes. I was worried. I was like, am I really going to do from start to finish runs? Am I just going to go until I lose? Um, and the answer is yes. So it's either Carnage or Iron Wave. Either one, I think, is not... We'll defend. We'll play Havoc. And we'll play Strike. That was worth it, actually. Havoc? Havoc is a very strange card. Um, oh, gotta go spot weakness. Gotta go with spot weakness. Uh, I think we need to heal. No, we need to smith the card. That's what we need to do. Um, it means that if you combine it with headbutt, you can get some really good stuff. Oh, ice cream is 110% what we need there. Uh, definitely want to upgrade. S Let's upgrade Carnage. Carnage Plus is actually like ridiculously more damage um let's go or calcum I uh, don't have enough to buy anything in particular but let's see true grit helps a lot war cry ah here we go war cry is what we need to combine with that uh, if we can get what we need here this is gonna work out really well um, dude, 100%, we just go, boom. Ah, we don't have enough to kill him now. Um, I guess we just kill the small guy and take 10. Oh, no, we're only going to take, f I could have, mm, I really couldn't have, actually. Yeah, there we go, this is what I wanted to do, actually. Havoc, hit you, hit you actually no reason to do anything but oh i'll just i'll just take the, the one damage so havoc can be good um if you can combine it with things that let you put cards on top of your deck pummel's good thunderclap i mean you gotta go with pummel for using spot weakness i think we can take an elite enemy yeah we can take an elite enemy um i don't think havoc is a good play here let's uh Let's go Warcry. 
put spot weakness back on top. Um, I don't really want to use Pummel here, but I should really just hit him as fast as possible. I should have put Pummel on top. Alright, so he's going to gain a little bit of strength, but overall, we're now in a much better position. I'll drink. Nah, it's not going to heal us fast enough. We have free block, so I'm not too concerned. We have extra energy this turn for some reason. Oh, I didn't spend it all last turn. Duh. Lantern's really good with ice cream. Um, Immolate's terrible with this. Rage, maybe? Not really. I mean, if we can... I think Heavy Blade. We have to go with higher cost. Uh, Only need one regen potion... I would rather have a strength potion there. Let's see if we can get a chest. A shop. Also fine. Um, Second wind. I don't think anything here is great. Dark shackles is okay. I think uppercut. Let's go with that. Let's buy uppercut. Let's keep moving. I mean, I don't even know how long we've been playing for, but... Uh, actually, you gotta upgrade Heavy Blade. Because five times is so much more damage. Alright, so for step one of this fight is I'm going to drink the potion. I'm going to play Warcry. 100% we've gotta save Pummel for later. But we don't... You know what? No. Yeah, we'll save Pummel for next turn. Hit you here. Hit you with this, and hit you with this. Next turn, we might be able to get a really good pummel off if we can get... Ah. Alright, we'll just we'll just use pummel anyway. Uh, 4 times 6. 6 plus 12, 12 plus 24. I think we can, we can afford to take the damage. I mean, this is actually just more damage, so... Let's just hit him with that. Um, spot weakness, definitely. Hit you with that. It's either a strike or a defend, so either one's fine by me. Perfect. This is going by so much faster. I love it. I love this new feature. Um, we can't kill him. So I may as well just play like that. Uh, I think a bash is better because it'll be vulnerable for one extra turn. I'm going to save my energy. And you're going to say, why are you doing that? Because I can get Heavy Blade and Carnage next turn. Like, why would I not do Heavy Blade and Carnage? If I had one more energy even, I'd be even happier. But let's just see if we can kill him. Oh, one turn. And we don't die, so I'm just going to... Continue. Having Orichalcum lets you be so much more aggressive, and I love it. If we could just get, um, oh my god, B Limit Break is exactly what we want. Uh, we gotta go with Ectoplasm. As much as I hate losing the ability to gain gold, extra that just means that we don't have to go to shops anymore. Um... We want to go to the first shop we can reach as fast as possible, and then never another shop again. So let's go this way. He's going to be an easy fight. Uh, we don't have any strength to start with to double. Let's bash. Strike. Strike. And end turn. There's nothing to be too concerned about. We are losing a little bit of HP here. But, we'll uppercut you. Put you with an iron wave. And I think that 21 damage is probably worth it. Probably don't want to take... Yeah, I, I have potions that I can do. I don't need to worry too much about my HP. Uh, he's dead. Dexterity potion. I mean... 
Sever Souls, fine. I don't think any of these are really what we're looking for at this point. Uh, explosive Potion's not very good. We'll go with Dexterity. Come on. Oh. Mmm. Do we get rid of our gold or do we go for the red mask? I say we go for the red mask. Let's do it. I should have kept that potion now that I think about it. You. I can kill you instantaneously. Use War Cry to try and get a better card. This is perfect. Hit this guy in the middle. He's going to do a huge debuff to me and it's going to suck. Oh no, it's just dexterity. Um. You're dead. You've taken a lot of damage. Six is exactly what we block for free anyway, so. I was worried about this fight. I've had it go really poorly multiple times before. And for it to just go so easily is really just a testament to how good this deck is. I think a block potion is worse than a dexterity. Flame barrier, I mean, we're, we're running low on block cards. Flame barrier is a nice, solid one, especially with a lot of energy. Oh my god, we don't have money for apotheosis. I don't like Dreamcatcher. I don't care about card removal right now. Jack of all trades is the second best thing to apotheosis. Um, we want to go for question marks because we can get chests. One hundred percent, we are in the best spot ever. Come on, give me the Necronomicon. Um, Milray's Codex is actually still pretty good. We haven't ever seen that on the series yet. Uh, what? Oh my God, they've all been weakened. I need to upgrade Limit Break ASAP. Uh, so I'll just use it now, because why not? I can get a pretty fast kill in on one of these guys, potentially. Rupture is useless. Brutality is useless. Evolve is usable, at least. I shouldn't have taken it, actually. Alright, so we want to immediately not play Evolve at all. Um... I can kill you, which reduces the damage a lot. I can hit... That's 10, but this will do. This will reduce my damage more. So it'll go down by 5 instead of down by like 2. Let's go for Whirlwind. Now, Nilri's Codex can be bad because you are adding cards to your deck. Let's just do that. Um, play Havoc, me as well. Uh, hit you again. Don't have any way of drawing cards, so we'll just go for 10 block. Oh, yeah, that's that's really good, actually. Um, let's just skip it. I don't need it. Alright. So, Flame Barrier... No, Whirlwind. We win. Uh, Havoc, Sword Boomerang, Corruption. Is Corruption good for us right now? No. Is Sword Boomerang good for us now? No. Is Havoc good for us now? No. None of these are good. Let's get out of here. Um, I think that Elite Enemies are the least of our concern. Because if we go this way, we have to fight two, and I don't think that's a good idea. We need to upgrade Limit Break so that it doesn't go away. Now we're in a really good position. Um, Flame Barrier, 100%. He's going to do 15. One of these is good. Pummel would be better later, so I'm going to expend energy on a strike and wait. Feed is great. We'll be able to just play feed. It'll exhaust after we play it. We might be able to get damage on him from it. Like, look at this. Spot weakness. Okay. Limit break. Um, We're actually really not in a good spot right now let's just let's just use it no no sense in saving it for later I'll go with this arm it's an exhaust anything in Nilri's codex that says exhaust is probably worth playing let's just kill him uh, we should be using our potions more that's that's probably where we're going wrong yeah, cleaves fine we'll go with cleave I don't want to fight him. 
even though we could get two question marks, let's just go this way. Sneko. All right. Um, Jack of all trades. Apotheosis. Boom. Uh. Why not? That's fine, I guess. It thins the deck out a bit. 100%. An another pummel for free? Great. Doesn't matter the cost, because everything's going to cost random amounts. Um, Eight blocks is enough to get rid of you. Let's just... uh, Dude, why not? Another limit break. Um, Strike for free. Great. I should have bashed first. I'll just save up the energy. No. I don't want any of them. We're in a bad spot right now. Uh, two times five. We don't have any... Alright. Well, that's enough to get rid of that. We'll just hit him with these twice in a row. Exhume is a good card for this. I would... No, no he's dead. Alright. Evolve, no. Heavy Blade. Eh. Burning Pack. Nah. Let's go for another Heavy Blade. That's fine. Uh, every time... The first time you use HP, draw three cards. Perfectly fine. I didn't... I, I went to this just to save some time, but I shouldn't have. You know what? Sure. Flex is... Flex is good. If we can get an artifact potion, we're good. I should have gone to the left. Damn it. Neither of you are doing anything useful. You need to die, like, immediately. Shockwave is a really good card for us right now. It's not permanent, so I'm not too worried about that. Um, flex. Limit break. Uh... Yeah, I just, just want to kill you. Hit you for bo both for that. Um, drink this immediately. And flame, I guess. So we do still have a little bit of extra strength, which is good. Um, you should die immediately. I'm still hexed. What do I want to put back on top? Let's put a daze back on top. That's fine. Uh, we can drink one of these and gain 14 and then hit you for that and that. Impervious sounds really good right about now. <laughs> I'm not liking our... Um, movement ahead right now. Uh, perfected Strike is a lot of damage. Especially since we haven't technically removed any. Oh my god, please. Please. Uh, I can kill this guy in almost one turn, and then... You know what? That's worth killing one of them in one turn. Add another Strike to the deck. Increase the power of Perfected Strike. Flame Barrier can block both of them. Heavy Blade has nothing to increase it off of. I think Bash is our best bet here. 100% Whirlwind is going to save our ass. Five to... Ah, oh, it's not enough. Alright, so here's the, here's the plan here. I just play Whirlwind. Because if I do anything else, I'm not going to have as much block at the end of turn. Um, no. No reason. Alright. Jack of all trades. That didn't really do us that much good, but flex. To limit break. To perfected strike. To cleave. Oh, thank god. I think seeing red is pretty good for us right now. 
I just need to survive this next fight. Oh, we might not. We might not. Okay, so we flex. War cry. I mean, there's no way I'm surviving this unless I do something amazing. Um. Like what? I I I'm dead. Damn it! I should have gone the other way. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I don't know how long we've been going for, but this is the end of the episode. <laughs> Good. Goodbye. How long did we go on that one? I have no idea. I'll just check the recording. Actually, I can just alt-tab to here. Wow, only 20 minutes. We might actually uh, never want to do that again like that. Uh, you know what? I'll just do one more episode for now. Um, tell me if you like the new format, if you feel like commenting, and I'll see you next time. Bye.